Okay. I'm I think their genre you're gonna super like. Okay. You said that it's a little bit more new metal, new or more um more metalcore. More like rap metal. I rap think. Metal. Okay. Yeah. So like new metal stuff. Yeah. Um, okay. Cool. He's good. Good, good drinks tonight. Not coffee. Not coffee. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Arsenic and Espresso, a podcast where we sometimes drink coffee, but tonight it is wine. And beer. But we always talk about metal music. We are going to react to a band called Fever 333. Okay. Um, they are a rap, rock, rap, metal, hardcore punk band that okay. formed in Inglewood, California in 2017. All right. July of 2017, so it is almost their third birthday. Yay. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, guys. Um, I found this band just a few weeks ago. Um, somebody, somebody I follow had posted them like in their Instagram stories. Okay. Um, but POD follows them on Instagram. Oh, awesome. Yeah, and so when I saw that, I was like, all right, That's cool. I'm sold. I don't even know what they sound like, but I'm sold. Let's get into this then. What um what song are we listening to? So we are going to be reacting to their song Supremacy. I don't feel like there needs to be a lot of explanation as to why. Um Okay. I can feel that. <laughs> I mean Is it a is it a newer song? I mean yes, they've only been yes. around for a few years. So they've but... only been around three years, but this song was released yes. Oh, the beginning of the month, June eighth. Yes. Okay. Between quarantine and between a crazy powerful civil rights movement days have blurred into one long day and i don't actually know when anything has happened anymore <laughs> it's true so I, I feel like we've been up feels, for 20 days straight it feels so. like a hundred years ago that i listened to this band okay fair enough Thanks. their monthly listeners on spotify is eight hundred sixteen thousand. okay and they so have one hundred forty three thousand followers on instagram okay so they're pretty big yeah so they have yeah. a pretty good following anyways let's, let's get into it get to this this is fever 333 their new single supremacy born into a world where we're trying to be free but we're living underneath their supremacy yeah 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 See, I was raised in the West, where we stay stressed, where they lie in the half through the making the rest. Cause we living in the shadow of the suburbs, while the price of this house going upwards. I don't understand how the poor getting robbed by the rich and they calling it a handout. Oh, and it's nah. evident, the neighborhood fucked up, by the sending letters to the president. Tell me, can you hear us through the sound of the sirens? And you wonder why the streets getting violent. Another mother shed tears at the cemetery bury in a first Child. I've been watching through the years, dominoes firing, waking up, screaming, let me live in a cold sweat. Segregated, they consider us a known threat, so we hopeless. The combination of current videos, mm -hmm. like current literal current events, right. paralleled with video clips from the, the civil rights movement. Right. So good. Also, though, um, they're it gives me the same vibes as like Rage, Rage Against the Machine, mm -hmm. right? Because you can just vibe to this song right now. His voice, um, so far, the music behind it and yeah. everything is just like you know, I could I could probably study to this music, yes. you know, and just have it vibing. Um, but then, like, then you look at the the lyrics and you hear what they're saying, and you're like, oh. Oh, that's why they're raging against the machine. You yeah, know, like exactly. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, so I'm getting the same sort of vibes. Yes. Hey. Born into
my DNA. Break it down into something easier to hate. They afraid of the outcome. Cause a race that they call human keep evolving and they know they will get outrun. That's why, huh? Tell behind on the time chain. Protest culture on strike like lightning. Who's it hold the control so we rise it? Put the muscle on, but we won't stay silent. Born into the world where battery died yes um so now we're going to finish the last like 30 seconds of this and then go over a quick lyric breakdown um so far i don't i mean I've do we need it. to do a lyric breakdown since the lyrics were posted on the video i think we can talk about we it still can't okay yeah. all right cool cool, 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 be good. cool all right um, let's finish this okay. and then go to bed because i'm sleepy yay okay I love when a song just ends. Yeah. No, I love that. No fade out or anything. No just, fade out. Just an, abru yeah. an abrupt end because like you're vibing, oh. you're feeling it and then it just stops and then you're still sitting there. Yeah. Doing this. Um, no, I, I, I like that. Um, mm -hmm. I like that a lot. I think that for me very much. So rage against the machine mm -hmm. energy. Mm -hmm. um, like I said before, it's because of, that, that it is content that like you listen to and you're like oh yeah, yeah like so they mad hell yeah you know yeah um but uh but yeah you can just vibe to it you can just i like i on. the yeah the instruments the beat his voice everything was like the vibe was really really good um when our camera died i mentioned that his vocals remind me of chester bennington from lincoln mm, park May yeah he rest in peace um, yeah. but his, the way he goes from like this, like scream to almost clean yeah. vocals back to like a really, um, like top of his throat scream sure. and like, you know, like his veins are bulging out around his eyes and neck because yeah. he's like forcing so much energy out of his face <laughs> in that right. moment. Very Chester right. Bennington. Um, well, and to be clear, like Chester is up here. Like yeah. nobody's touching Chester. No, he's we he's love goat. Chester. Um, um, but the style. The, yeah, the, the style. The sound is very his, familiar. Yeah. yeah. His vocals were very reminiscent of that for me. Um, back to the music video itself. I, the, the super powerful imagery of having images from the, f the first civil rights movement and then images from the current protests and riots. Super, yeah. super powerful. Um, I mean, I'm curious to know, like, did they write this song literally in the, like, like, 13 days right. after Floyd's death? Did they write this song, put out this video, like, 12 or 13 days after yeah. he was killed? Like, that is incredible. Um, obviously, life sparks art, and what is happening in our lives causes us to create whatever we can in that moment yeah. and so um th yeah the fact that they put this out um the lead singer his name is i i liked this song a lot i'm excited to yeah. hear more from them um and hopefully we can get a couple more reactions of them in um because i want to see what their other style is similar to the to the other video that we just put out i'm curious if mm -hmm. this is um for lack of better words, put out for the cause. Um, and so it's not exactly their same style, yes. um, but similar. Right? Or if this is like exactly their style, like if, yeah. if everything this um, politically fueled is everything right. this and much I felt of like this a was statement. A fairly mellow song for, mm -hmm. um, for especially rock, their, you know, yeah, for, their genre, that hardcore punk. Or, uh, yeah. 
Yeah, so the the lead vocalist is Jason Butler. Um, Stephen Harrison is lead guitar. And then Eric, with an A, okay. is uh, drums. It was a really powerful song. Yeah. I think their sound is really powerful. Putting aside the content of the video yeah. and the song, the sound is really powerful. Um, I mean, it's only three guys, and it has a really... Yeah. Um, well-rounded sound, yeah. I feel. I I enjoyed it. I'm, I liked it a lot, and I'm excited yeah. to hear more. Um, I want to go over those lyrics again. Um, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Really yeah. quick. I'll do um, that. Because I think that those are powerful. Um, and, and while we were <laughs> while the camera was off, you were talking about... Um, well, I guess let's go over the, the lyrics, and we can talk about it. But. Okay. So, born into a world where we are dying to be free, living underneath their supremacy... 